Ash Wednesday opens the season of Lent. Have you ever asked the question, why is this season called Lent? I have three answers. The first meaning of Lent in German is spring. It is springtime, especially for Europe. In the Philippines, it is summer. And in the middle of the Lenten season, the trees become dry, the plants become dry, and the grasses also become dry. But you know what? During the time when the trees become dry, it is also the time when the roots of the trees sink more deeply into the earth. In other words, it is also springtime, but it is not a springtime that we can see from the leaves and the flowers. It is springtime for the roots. So Lent is springtime for the soul. When you go to Europe, when you go to America, you will see flowers abloom during the season of Lent. Because Lent is that. It is springtime for the soul. It is sacrifice, yes. It is prayer, yes. It is charity, yes, but the soul flourishes. The soul is refreshed during the season of Lent. On an ordinary Wednesday, you don't get so many people at the cathedral, but it is Wednesday, it is 8 o'clock, there is no usual schedule, and you are here because Ash Wednesday is spring for the soul. It is Lent. The second meaning of Lent in Latin Lente means slowly. Slowly. If you have been moving very fast during the season of Lent, slowly walk. Slowly run through life and appreciate the little things that you have ignored. Slowly. Because haste makes waste. Yung pagtakbo natin ng sobrang tulin, pare-pareho naman tayo ng pupuntahan. We end up tired with life. We end up fatigued. We end up exhausted. So the Lenten season is also a time to slow down and then to appreciate the breeze, to appreciate family, to appreciate the friends that we have ignored to connect once more with the parents that we have not seen for so long because we are so busy with our career, we are so busy with ourselves. The second meaning of Lent is slowly. The first meaning of Lent is springtime. It is time for new blooms and new flowers and new leaves. There is still a third meaning. Lent. Lent in English is the past tense of lend. When somebody lends, the other person borrows. When another borrows, the other person is lending. So, Lent is also a time to remember that everything we have is borrowed. Everything we have is borrowed. And God is the big lender. The big lender is not the best pawn shop. The big lender is not the kindest bank. The biggest lender is God Himself. He has lent us so much. But there will be a time when we have to return what we have borrowed. There will be a time when we have to return what He has lent to us. And that time will be a day when we remember, you are dust, and unto dust you shall return. This season of Lent, this Ash Wednesday, let us reflect on those three meanings of Lent. Lent is springtime. Lent is time to go slowly. Lent is time to remember Everything is borrowed and you have to return 
what you have borrowed, but you must return it cheerfully with abundance. Remember you are dust, and unto dust you shall return. <laughs>